my name is Brenna Klane Washinawatik, and I'm a student at Diné College. Tatna Zane Nishle, Techitni Beshishchin, Batatni Deshiche, Do Todichitni Deshanela. I'm originally from Upper Fruitland, New Mexico, and I currently live and work in Farmington, New Mexico, with my husband and our two children. I enrolled in the Navajo Cultural Arts Program in the spring of 2021. This was after much reflection from the start of the pandemic of 2020. The pandemic caused so much chaos, fear, isolation, and anxiety. And it happened to be my weaving that gave me peace of mind from this turmoil and helped me process the psychological and existential challenges of the pandemic. Thus, my weaving became much more important to me as a fifth generation weaver. As I ended up reaching out to Diné College as its, its mission is to help the well-being of the community. <clears throat> I entered the program in the spring of 2021 with some experience as I had learned how to weave plain weave from my maternal grandmother, Mary Willie, when I was in second grade. However, since I enrolled in the program, I had discovered so much more about myself. I figured out what it means to be a Diné cultural artist, as well as the cultural responsibilities that come with it. I expanded my weaving skills from plain weave to twill weave, wedge weave, and sash belt weave. And here is a sample of the sash belts that I had made as a student at Diné College. I also learned how to process wool. I learned how to shear, wash, card, and spin my own wool. I also recently learned how to dye wool using natural plants as well as with acid dyes. In addition to expanding my skills, I also um, expanded my knowledge about cultural arts history, business practices, professional development for artists, community engagement, juried art shows, and the use of social media to promote my art. All of this came together at the Navajo Cultural Arts Week at Diné College at the end of April. There and my participation in cultural art weeks, I felt I had a better self-understanding of myself as an artist. I definitely gained a lot of self-confidence as an artist. And I also developed and appreciated interpersonal skills as I had given two presentations during Navajo Cultural Arts Week. My first presentation was on the Andean two ply and then my second presentation was on the Navajo three ply. <clears throat> I was also happy to see my three pieces of artwork that I had submitted uh, on display at the Navajo, at the Ned Hatafli Museum at Diné College. I am gra very grateful for the program at Diné College. I am very grateful for everyone who helped support and was part of the Navajo Cultural Arts Program. Had it not been for the support of the Navajo Cultural Arts Program, I don't think I would have been admitted as an artist to the 2022 Santa Fe Indian Market. So I wanna thank everyone who helped, helped me succeed. And this is just the beginning of my career as a weaver and an artist. Thank you everyone.